Since April of last year, insurance companies have been dropping homeowner policies throughout California. I'm Avery Elowit, your neighborhood reporter in Fraser Park. And here in the mountains, it's been especially difficult for some residents. If you can't insure it, you can't sell it. Throughout the state, many people are struggling to renew their homeowner's insurance. In the mountains, Brad Graves says he was blindsided. When they sent me the official notice, it didn't state why. And fighting tooth and nail through the state insurance commission, I found out that they required a certain certificate. Following multiple back and forth emails with his insurance company, Graves said he was missing a new requirement, the wildfire preparedness certificate. But by the time he got this answer, it was too late. The cost and timing to get that, it just wasn't feasible. The letter stated they would reconsider, so it was really no guarantees. Graves says he was fortunate enough to get an out-of-state insurance plan at an increased rate. My homeowner's was 1250 bucks a year, and I was willing to pay more, but I think they're just trying to weed out people one by one. And now he says he is dealing with a 200% increase. About $3,600 a year, which I'm grateful compared to what I heard, other people are paying. People are paying seven, nine, ten thousand dollars And I just talked to the owner of this establishment out here before I talked to you and knew somebody that's paying 15000 I reached out to Farmers Insurance for a response. And while they declined to comment on an individual decision, they did say, quote, We do review our coverage exposures on an ongoing basis to better manage our risk in the state. You can read the full statement on our website, turna23.com. Meanwhile, Graves is calling on help from local officials to help get this issue solved. I think our government and our politicians need to get something done and correct this problem with the insurance company. I hear word, they're trying, but if anything gets changed, it's not going to happen for a couple years. We'll have details on our website, turna23.com. In Fraser Park, I'm your neighborhood reporter, Avery Elowit.